Turing, combining, and splitting tables are also very easy to do. Table 1 just expressed how table 2 is a little noisy and would rather sit somewhere more quiet. No problem, let me find them a table that's a little bit more secluded. I'll select the transfer button, which then prompts me to select which table to move. Let's move table 1 over to table 11 in the corner. And that takes care of that. Now let's say that table 3 sees table 5 and they happen to know each other and request to be seated together. I can merge one table to the other by utilizing the merge function. Simply select the tables that you'd like to combine and then hit done. Now you can see that the tables have been combined onto one. Table 11 has finished their meal and they're ready to pay. The customers want their tabs on one check but recall I placed them on two separate checks when I first put the order in. The split check functions give me the option to divide the check by item and even amount per person or by groups of seats or just to put all the items back on one check. Just as an example, split evenly puts all items on both checks but divides the total number of seats to get an even two-way split. This includes the drinks and appetizers as well. You can always hit the start over button to go back to where you were. As you can see, I can select whichever individual items and move them over from one check to the other. I could also open up another check and start adding items to that as well. Now let's go ahead and close this table out. 